Hello Rich, this is Greg Claxon, your real estate agent here in sunny Sarasota. Just showing you uh, the drive up video to River Strand. They have a beautiful um, central park over here with a massive lake uh, dock where you can go fishing from. They a lot, many times have uh, events out here in this uh, movies on the lawn, uh, soccer, etc. out there. You can see the golf course, one of the golf, many golf courses over here. I play this, uh, this one actually, this is not River Strand, this is called Heritage Harbor or Stony Brook, technically, uh, to the right here. So there's a, my, one of my friends from high school actually is the golf pro there. So maybe we can get some lessons over there at Stony Brook. Um, it's really nice community here. This is a hard hole actually, not my favorite. I just wanted to show you the quick drive up here to River Strand, which is a community within a community. So it, it's in a community called uh, Heritage Harbor and it's separate. So you can see the uh, River Strand entry there. I'm gonna take you through this entrance. Let's see if they let me in here. See the waterfall, the stop sign, and must be another uh, uh, Heritage Harbor. So sorry for the pause here. I'll chop this up. Just trying to get you the information you need. There's the drive up. The landscaping is uh, really well appointed. Here's the guard stand. For River Strand and the gates. So I'm gonna let them know I'm coming in to see the property. Stand by. Driving in. Gonna take a left here into the sanctuary at River Strand, which is where these villas are. And get a little bit of a three minute drive out here to your the villa in question. Uh, here on the front side is uh, single family homes it looks like. Speed limit 25 miles per hour. Uh, lots of green St. Augustine grass. You can notice the landscaping uh, looks really nice in this community. They do a nice job. They have a lot of uh, larger um, lush trees magnolias, oak trees, palm trees. There's a neighbor crossing the street right there. Hi neighbor. I'm <laughs> checking her mail I guess. Keep heading this way. We're gonna take a left onto Willowshire, which is coming up. That'll be where all the villas are. You can see we're still in single family home area. Willowshire is, uh, actually it says, uh, whatever, same difference, I'm gonna go this way. This is Wild Lake. Take a left here, see more single family homes. There's uh, one of the large lakes there, ponds if you wanna call it a pond. Let's drive it to the neighborhood. Fast forward this if this is going too slow for you, I just want you to show you the actual drive if you come home every day or when you're here on vacation, this is what your drive would be every day, coming through the neighborhood. One thing I didn't point out, maybe I'll grab it on the way out, is uh, there's a playground, uh, some baseball fields quite a far distance away at the beginning. Um, again, the public course at Stony Brook. Uh, my friend is the uh, golf pro there. I can hook us up on some free golf. Maybe I shouldn't say that on video. But um, <laughs> here we go, turning left. All right, making our way. So I'm trying to drive and take a video, so it's uh, a little harder than it looks. Oh, good thing I didn't come the other way because the other way would bring me to these gates, which are just for residents. So I had to come to the main entrance. So this is a, a entrance back to where I first entered um, Port Harbor uh, for residents only. I can exit there, of course. So uh, here now on Willowshire. You see the uh, lawn landscaping people heading over to the property. All right, we're still heading over here. Oh, here's 6645. Just pulling up to the property here. There's someone in front of me. It's a Mercedes. Lots of activity here, so give me a second and I'll uh, show this property to you. Alrighty, hey Rich, uh, welcome home. We are in the uh, property that we've been discussing. 
Walking in the entrance, which is on the side, you walk into the foyer area. You can go left and that heads towards the lake, the living room, and the master. You go to the right and you hit the laundry room and the second bedroom. So here you can see the second bedroom. You got a ceiling fan. Here is the bed, nightstand, the uh, wall art, and then a closet here. It's a basic uh, closet, obviously not a walk-in. Little TV in the corner. We'll head over this way. You'll see the linen closet here in the second bedroom. Get an idea of the spacing there. And then to your right here, we have the air condition handler, the Lennox. All right, going out that door is the garage. I'll do that last since I'm inside. So again, you have the, the side entry here. You can see it back this way. Head over to the dining room. Oh, the phone's ringing, hello. <laughs> Here's the dining room. There's a china cabinet. You have a lot of space here to walk around. I'll walk you around for a second. Get you the different angles. And see here's the den um, to your left, which is not a bedroom, but it's they're using it as a living space for additional living space. Let's see the uh, couches here. We got a, a like a, la a lazy boy type chair, a couch. See if it is a pull-out couch. It is not a pull-out couch. A desk. And double uh, French doors here. Or double glass doors. The side yard here, you have a bunch of hedges and your lake view starts over there. Alright, so coming out of the den, back to the dining room. Where's the hub of this place? You have the kitchen. And this kitchen has stainless appliances. You have your pantry here. Your stainless refrigerator and freezer side by side. It's a GE. And then you have the 42 inch cabinets with the crown molding, double the crown molding up here in the entire uh, living space. And then you have the crown molding above the cabinets as well. Hope this is helpful. You have a granite countertop. It's a darker color. Here's your range. Also a GE, I believe. Yes, it is a GE. So everything is GE, GE, and GE. So it does match. You do have knobs on these cabinets. A backsplash of tile. And then also your GE stainless dishwasher. Double sink with a disposal. And here we are. Your kitchen. There is a nice light up there to let some natural light come in from the side. This is an end unit, as you probably already know. I'll do a circle here for you so you can get this. From the tip of the kitchen, you have the den, you have the foyer over there with your second bedroom, and then your dining room here with a hutch. And now we're going into the great room. As you can see, it's a pretty typical square room. And then it walks out to the patio. Now in some of these other homes I've seen, you have the wall right there. And it appears like over there you see an enclosure. That those have screen lanai extension enclosures. This one does not have that, it's just the covered space. So I'm assuming if you wanted to put that in, you could because everyone else has one, at your expense, of course. Here's the couches and the chair. It's a wicker style, kind of Florida style. I'll have a seat here for a second. Ah, oh, okay, there we go. All right, pretty comfortable. 
Got a large king bed that I can see over there into the master. I'm going to get up here for a second and head you that way. It's your master bedroom. Two end tables. Some wall art. A dresser. Mirror. And then your lake view right there. You do have sliding glass doors from your master and from the main living area. We'll go out there in a minute. Walk into your master bathroom. Closets on both sides. Standard closets. A little bit wider actually, but uh, not walk-ins. Same size. And you have your bathtub shower combo right here. Frosted glass for privacy and blinds. And uh, here's your shower. Looks pretty clean. Hey guys, I got my golf attire on. Hope you're having a good day. Double sinks. Same cabinets that are in the bathroom. Or in the kitchen. All right, got my mask on, so it's a little harder to navigate here. Going outside, show you the outdoors. Here you go. Some neighbors to your left over there. I'm panning left to right. Here's that privacy wall. Alrighty, that's what I know, coming back inside. And we'll walk out of the garage. That concludes our tour inside of the home. And we'll head on out this way. Here's a two car garage, paver brick driveway. And I'll walk you back to the inside. All right, walking around here to the back of the home, just give you a quick run around here. Full circle around the home. Well, not full circle because there's two villas here, but here you go. Coming around the corner of your home. And there's the lake again and the backyard. So that's it. That's what I got for today. Take this mask off. Hey, thank you for uh, working with me, guys. Looking forward to helping you find a place, whether it's this or another one. Again, my name is Greg Claxton with Florida VIP Realty. You got my number, Rich. Uh, let's talk. Have a good day. Bye.